how to composite cutouts easily in Photoshop. First, import the cutout to Photoshop and scale it properly into the image. One tip is to align the person's head to the perspective lines of the image. You can actually create a guide like this. Next, we can easily composite these cutouts by clicking on the cutouts layer. Go to Filters, Neural Filters, then select Harmonize. In this drop-down, we need to select the rendered image as our reference and make the strength to about 50. Click OK and it will automatically blend the image. Next, select the layer and make a copy below it. In Blending Options, you will add a color overlay and set it to black. Press Ctrl T, right click, and select Distort. Adjust the corners of the image to create a shadow. Make sure where the shadows are heading and click Enter. Next, select the layer, then go to Filters, Blur, then Gaussian Blur. Set the blur to about 5 pixels and click OK. Next, create a mask on the layer, select a black soft brush, and paint over the shadow to create a fade. We will also add hue and saturation since the shadows have blue tints. Do the same steps again to the other cutouts and add some details such as reflections. If you have a case where the person is sitting on the grass like this, one hack is to add another mask on the layer by placing it in a group. Use a grass texture brush and paint over it like this. You can also add a camera raw filter when everything is done. And that's how you easily composite cutouts in Photoshop. Like and follow for more.